ancient Celts didn't possess uniform armor. Instead, it varied depending on personal preference, tribal customs, unit type, and the opponent. The lack of archaeological finds suggests the early versions seemed to be made of perishable materials like leather, linen, felt and hemp. What we have are depictions and statues that indicate that their armor resembled the classical style of so-called yokan tube, consisting of cylindrical body, shoulder flaps, and a fabric skirt-like form. To this was also added a cape that protected a warrior's rear and neck. The continuous evolution of a warrior's equipment led to Celts adopting chainmail armor, which consisted of thousands of interlocking metal rings that better protected against slashes and cuts. Such pieces usually weighed between 10 and 20 kilograms, depending on the number and thickness of rings. A warrior had to wear additional layers of felt or leather below the mail, cushioning the weight, preventing rubbing and providing additional protection against thrusting and blunt weapons. Such armor was limited to the most prominent warriors and nobles.